In this video, you'll see how we grow weeping willow cuttings to grow liners for in our field to grow weeping willow trees. We start with these water spouts that are on the base of this tree that was buck rubbed. We can use these because they're nice and straight and they contain a lot of energy and they'll root out easily. In this video, you'll see how we do it. We take the cuttings and we put them in water and we put the stems in the water about four to five inches. We mark the cup so that we know exactly how much water we start with because we like to maintain the water level at the same level throughout the rooting process. These cuttings will probably take three to four weeks to root out well enough to put in a potting media, such as our potting soils that we use at Highland Hill Farm to grow our trees. It won't take long. We like to keep the plants misted, and we do that by setting up a very simple misting operation in the room so that these trees will have foliage that stays moist while they're rooting out. You don't have to spend a lot of money on a misting system to keep your cuttings moist. I do it by allowing a hose to just drip on an elevated platform above where the foliage is located. And thus, the splashes come down in a random pattern very slowly over a long period of time, keeping the cuttings very moist. Simple solutions are always better than complicated ones. Additionally, when you're visiting at Highland Hill Farm, ask to see our Indian artifact collections that we have from various properties that we've searched for arrowheads on throughout the United States. And we also have properties where you can go and discover Indian artifacts for yourself. We have properties in Montana, New Mexico, and Pennsylvania which are rich in Indian archeological finds. So call us at Highland Hill Farm, 215-651-8329 and stop in and see our Arrowhead collection. 